Turn it up, DD. Let's see if we can get some heads nodding around here. So how did you end up on the wrong side of the law? After my studies, I worked in the Republic Tax Collection Agency investigating revenue disputes. You were a tax collector? Sounds pretty legitimate so far. Drearily legitimate. But it did introduce me to a steady procession of people desperate for things to shake out in their favor, so to speak. And you helped them out for a price. Yes. But my fee was nothing compared to the price they paid at the hands of a corrupt system. Whatever you say, Moran. Not now. Barkeep. and warriors alike. Hey, buddy. Hiya, Cal. You and Droid seem to get along, don't you? Sure do. Always had trouble connecting with people. Droids are logical, easy to fix when broken. People are unpredictable. No kidding. But once you find the right person, Gets easier. Hope so. Great to see you. What's your academy like? Oh, amazing. Every building is partially suspended with repulsors. The campus looks like it's floating over the ground. It's magical. It sounds like a hard place to leave behind. It was, but things were changing. Looking down, you used to see nothing but nature. The ground is covered in ferrocrete now. All part of an Imperial control zone. Take care out there, Cal. You too. You asked how life was different in my day. For one, I believe we were more charitable to one another. Yeah, the Empire has everyone so afraid they just look out for themselves. What was it like back then? Once I was running an errand for Master Cree, very time-sensitive business. I moved with such haste, I blew off my motivator. I was perfectly aware and completely immobile. Most embarrassing. How'd you get moving again? By chance, a friendly bystander diagnosed my predicament and graciously installed a replacement. That's generous. Out here, they'd probably scrap you for parts. How'd you repay them? I didn't. I never saw him again, but weeks later, I was able to help someone else. A chain of kindness kept the Republic going. For a while. Cal, I don't want to be that droid, but Cannibal won't discover itself. Does any of this interest you? Life has not changed too drastically. Oh, don't spare my circuits. Tell me what you really think. Well, sure, things are different. Back home, practically every lab is under military funding. But things are a lot like under the Republic. We go about our lives, send delegates to the Senate, vote. What a vote is worth these days. It's so difficult to imagine a galaxy without the Jedi. Like a trifle without his redemption spark. Savior 
never returns. Let me make a proper introduction. I am Bima Ook, and this is my associate, Tali Boot. As you can see, we have set up the game of Hollow Tactics here in Pailoon Saloon. I'm Cal. Glad you made it back safe. I'd say the same to you, but it seems there is no doubt that you can handle yourself. I see you have a companion droid. They can add to your Hollow Tactics deck by scanning combatants. Uh, got it. The more scans BD collects, the more options I'll have in the game. Exactly. Of course, there is nothing stopping you from playing right now. Care to play a game of Hollow Tactics? Okay. You'll never beat me! are looking good for Cal! That unit is toast! Was it too easy for you? Oh, you're 
think he can take on old Grease? Chance. The odds have spoken, I'm afraid. Turbo Dog, how much do I earn? So, you think you can take on old Grease? fully played.
Hold on, wait a minute. Why don't we raise the stakes a little bit? This will be a true contest of minds. Strategy proved superior. sequence of play. The 
It seems I am lacking in clear strategy. Let the battle 
all begin! Obliterated! That unit is toast! Oh, so long, farewell! That's the round to Cal Kestis! Streak continue. Snow ways to go 
Ways to 
Here's your strategy wasn't up to the challenge.
stood a chance. And it's off the board. That unit is toast. Now that's a hollow kill. An unfortunate loss. Strategy proved superior.
wonder if you can find others to challenge out there. Coruscant, Greece. Wish I had you by my side. Yeah, me too. There'd be less to repair on the Manning. Did you ever have any close calls like that? Oh, yeah. I was on the Ryloff system one time. Suddenly, I see three modified light corvettes on my tail. Oh, oh yeah, it was bad. Weak way pirate. I tried every evasive move in the book. Full throttle, I couldn't lose them. So how'd you escape? I managed to divert the power from the ship's climate control to its engines. It gave me the extra boost to shake those pirates off, <laughs> and a new trick to push the Mantis whenever I needed it. That's why the Mantis always gets colder at full speed. A greasy secret. Don't you tell nobody. I'll be here, Cal. How long have the Raiders been here? A few years. Not long after I arrived. I don't know a planet in the Outer Rim free of raiders in general, but these bedlam bastards have changed Kobo forever. Most hunters know you call when you need to, and you stop hunting when a herd gets too low. These raiders kill for sport, and made a lot of those beasts much more hostile to us. Take Shiverpedes, for example. When they lose habitat, they get territorial and fight back. Same as us, really. Sure enough. Biggest mistake our kind ever made was thinking we are any different. Later, BD. How'd you get mixed up with the Bedlam Raiders? Whoa, well, I had a drink from Muck. Then another, then another, then another, then... Right. I stumbled outside and sort of confused one of the big Raiders with a do-back. Don't tell me you try to mount him. Okay. But if I don't, that's the end of the story. I can see where the raiders try to kill you. Oh, they've got plenty of reasons. Hiya. You seem different in here, Cal. How so? Well, you're more relaxed, for sure. I guess. Grease did a good job with this place. Feels like home. Grease. <laughs> Not sure I'll ever meet another Latero like him. Uh, that was supposed to be a compliment. We'll talk soon. So, this whole running around the galaxy, beating down bullies thing you've got going on? What do you get at? Well, it's a better use of my time than drinking my life away in a cantina. That's wrong, my God. A lot of prospectors around here. Have you ever tried your hand at mining prior, right? What? I found it enlightening. Some prospectors invited me to join them on an expedition. We descended to the mines, but when my back was turned, they fled. They ditched you? Yes. Alone, I calmly walked through the darkness, trusting my intuition. I found another exit. And the prospectors? Must be alone now. So how'd you become a music producer? I was born on Riosa, in the Inner Rim. I've heard of it. Lots of heavy industry. Yeah, you couldn't escape the factories. So I used to make little tunes out of the noise from them in my head. You started early then. And never stopped. Enjoy the tunes. Do you ever miss the glory days, Cal? The cut and thrust, the rough and tumble. It sounds like every day. Not that it's glorious. Well, I certainly had some glorious years. I'm sure I never told you about the incident over at Munilinst. Don't think you did. I was personally escorting a shipment of, let's call it a sensitive luxury product. Unfortunately, we were costed by a customs longship. The fence had failed to update our transponder codes, and our vessel was marked. 
while push comes to shove, and we were boarded. I've got three customs officers waving blasters under my nose, so what do I do? I throw on the waterworks. Oh, Cal, you cannot imagine. I'm swearing up and down about everything from past marriages to lower back pain. Almost worked, too. But one pesky officer decided to kick open a shipping container full of the slightly incriminating powder. Guess the jig was up. No, oh, Cal. Cal, Cal. You're looking at a professional. I told them that they were looking at the ashes of a thousand ritually cremated Sereno war heroes. And by the stars, they bought it. The inspectors actually bought it. That, Cal, is why I'm here instead of rotting in a Munilinst work camp. Talk later, hmm? Gear could use a refresh. New look for you, BD. Same great attitude. I can definitely work with that.
So who's this seer we're going to see? A mentor of mine. Rescued me from the Empire on Braca and dragged me halfway across the galaxy. Sounds like you two went through a lot together. We did. Been a long time since I've seen her. Want to set out? In my experience, you gotta chase a lead when it's hot. Haven't used these since the scrapyard on Braca. Prof gave them to me. How's it feel to be back on the Mantis? Good. Thinking about whipping up some curried burra fish. Kitchen looks in better shape than the rest of the ship, kid. I definitely saw less action since you left. You're telling me. The spice levels haven't moved. Did you cook even one decent meal for yourself these last years? I'm not half the cook you are, Grease. And maybe only three quarters the pilot. Very kind, but the first chance we get, I'm making you a plate of Great Granny Pyloon's Umber Hatch. My favorite. Can't wait. So, we headed to Jeddah or what? 